weeks. I had once a Chinese girl in a workshop here. She said it, in Chinese it's called the tree without flowers. Uh, because that is true, a fig tree has no flower. Uh, but actually the fig has the flower inside. Yeah? So, so this, this, uh, this flower grows inside. Uh, and here, now since it's uh, quite dry here, you see how when it's open, how beautiful, how fruitful, how lively this, this, this flower is. Uh, this fruit is actually out of this rather uh, unspectacular skin here. Uh, and that is a little bit the same in the human. Uh, and maybe more in a metaphoric way that that there is a beauty inside of everybody uh, the, the the beauty of 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 the creation the beauty of the being the, the and and that beauty often is is uh, of course uh, covered from something yeah covered from a from clothes covered from <coughs> from a, a mental state uh, covered from from uh, habitual movement, rules from the society, from, from the civilization. Uh, and what we try is to, to open that body that that inner flower can grow, uh, that the inner flower can express itself, that inner beauty can be shown up. Uh, because otherwise, when you, when you don't do that, when you just close it, yeah, you, you harm yourself. Yeah, you, 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 were, you work against your nature on one hand. Yeah. So that's why it's so important to have those two things together. Yeah? The physical movement, yeah? the opening here, we can see it's an opening. But then it's also wow, uh, touching, uh, a smell comes out, uh, a color comes out. Uh.